Hello friends, welcome to History and Mythology. If you like this video, then please don't forget to subscribe our channel. So without losing time, let's start today's video. It was the year 2018, a small village of India was getting attention for a lot of discussion. What was exactly happening there? In the coming years, India was about to witness an extraordinary discovery which happened in the field of archaeology. Archaeological Survey of India team successfully unwrapped a hidden layer of Indian past and found an extraordinary Bronze Age chariot in the village of Sinoli, which was dated back 2000 BC and was driven by the horses. This was the first time when any such artifact has discovered in India in archaeological excavations. Why this discovery is important for India and Indians? For this, we have to explore ancient Indian scriptures like Mahabharata and Ramayana. In the Mahabharata and Ramayana, the use of chariot was very common. Whether it was a full battle scene or a journey to any place, were always done through the chariot. But before today, no evidence of such chariot was found in any archaeological excavations, which raised a big question mark on the event which happened in those legions. However, it is possible to trace the period of Ramayana and Mahabharata through the astronomical information given in the scriptures. Archaeologists have found the evidence of Mahabharata dating from the Ehole inscription. If you have not seen our video of the dating of Mahabharata, then its link is given in the description. Sinauli, a small town in Uttar Pradesh, India, but since 2018, this town of Uttar Pradesh has been in a lot of discussion. And this is because of the one important archaeological excavation in which 4,000 year old chariot have been found. This discovery has given a new dimension to the ancient history of India and some such evidences has been presented which is very important in repelling the Aryan invasion theory. During the excavation happened in 2018, many bodies were found and out of that a few were buried along with their chariot. And the study of this chariot shows that these vehicles were pulled by the horses, which gives an entirely new dimension to an old debate about the use of horses in India. The excavation at Sinoli unearthed eight symmetries and several artifacts, including three coffins, antenna sword, daggers, comb, and ornaments. The meeting of chariot in the cemetery can also be interpreted to mean that this place must have been reserved for the royal family. A number of coffins have been discovered in the excavation at Sinoli, usually with four feet and closed by a thick cover on the top. The coffins were engraved with deep carving and covered by a thin layer of copper. Two chariots have been found buried near the feet of the coffin. The wheels of this chariot are stirred with solid triangular piece of copper. The overall frame of the vehicle is lighter which was further attached to the horse by a longer shaft. The study of this vehicle suggests that this vehicle was designed in such a way that helped the charioteer to remain stationary while the chariot was moving. On seeing the shape of a chariot, it is known that at one time two persons would have been able to travel together in this vehicle. A sword, dagger, seal and a helmet means that the people living here must have belonging the warrior class. The discovery of clay and copper utensils and combination of C-type beads, combs and a copper mirror allude to sophisticated craftsmanship and a rich lifestyle. A female burial with sword, shield, bow and arrow which easily tells us that women were also part of warrior classes. One interesting fact with female burial is that 
woman's leg were cut from ankle while buried in two maybe that was their ritual but logic behind this is still unknown the chariot found at sinoli belonged to ocp culture around 2000 bc the ocp people were using copper hoed battle axes harpoons and antenna swords it appears that they were importing copper objects from all over india at that time ocp people were using horses also for their war machinery the find at sinoli reinforces this conclusion because the chariot buried are horses driven light chariot used in wars sport and game these chariot continued to be used by local people as evident by sachi and bharut panel